Um, obviously, regular triangles. I think I showed you the norm triangle where they kind of go in for a. So you have a regular triangle. Look here. One, two, and there you go. Triangle on head, angle, and there's a triangle. Sometimes you're here and then they dive their arms underneath right here, okay? Because this right arm is in, okay? I can still get a triangle right here because I have my hand in and it's replacing his arm, okay? But you have to have this deep enough here, preferably kind of under the neck here as my leg goes across and he can't quite pull his head out because it's stuck because of my arm and then you just start adjusting your arm. There's also such a thing as called a dead orchard, okay? Dead orchard is where you triangle with both arms in. And you could do, it's typically done in no gi, Eddie Bravo is an expert at it, obviously here, look, once again, look, one, two, here, okay, maybe I have an arm lock, maybe not, but when I bring this, this arm together here, watch what I can do here, Because it's a narrow space between his shoulders and arms, he's already stuck in what's called a dead orchard. In this right here, it, it's a done deal because what typically they do is he can't push that in, and this arm is in jeopardy, and they start pulling out. The more he pulls out, he pulls out into a dead orchard. Triangle right here. It's very effective in no gi because you don't have the gi getting in the way. You just need to pin the arms together. And because you have a high guard, you already have that angle. So we're here. If your legs aren't long enough, you can just continue to do the first one here. Look. One. Two. As I bring this arm together here, I grab the <laughs> on a better angle. Right here. I can take this all out. Because this is a problem. All of this is a problem right here. And typically they literally start trying to pull out. And the more he pulls out, the more that arm gets stuck right there. So you see all of this pass. You know, you can have all kinds of stuff right here. All right? So the way you just need an angle. So you can try. If your legs are long enough, I go under. Go move this up here. As I bring him down here, but. I need to get over the shoulder here. I see a lot of you kind of going across here. The shoulder, push it down, and you're right here. If he's hiding this arm right here, nothing's stopping you from bringing it over here. And then you go across right here, grab your shin, but this arm is still controlling that arm. And now it's a dead organ. Because now I have this arm right here. The whole time you're holding that lapel. The whole time I'm holding that lapel. That's why I can unlock my leg and get the, the triangle. So I'm here, look. High guard is what I showed you here. Just look, pull that arm across, maybe you'll be here, right across the neck, right across the shoulder. It's a done deal right here. Because I can across this, and I'm pulling, pull your right arm out. Yeah, you can't pull it out. He's right here, and I got both shoulders here. He's in the done deal here. Because typically they'll try to just pull out. Yeah, right there. Yeah, and it's even worse right there. Because he put himself into a sweet zone here, you can even see it. But try. And you got to get it right around the shoulder. So, last time here. You can do it. If not, just do this. For those of you who want to just practice the arm like you're, you're going to move it across here. And here. Same entry here. You want the arm line. I'm gonna push and tilt him to the left as this leg comes over, and this leg comes over, and my knees open. See how that opens up? I want to twist my hips to the left to drive his head down, okay? If he tries to stack me, see how my tilt is left? If I'm tilted this way, he'll stack. Now open the knees up, and you finish. You want that dead orchard, same thing here. I move this all the way back to here. Reach through, grab your shin. Lock four, shin, hip, and lock. And now you got the orchard. 
handed to them because his arms are all here. And you can't, and you can't really do much to get out of it other than that right there. Okay? For those of you 